Okay, cool. What's up? It's go time. Good evening. Who's here? <clears throat> Get all my stuff arranged. Well, to start, I looked high and low for a microphone. I couldn't find anything. I just don't really know what to look for. <laughs> I went, like I looked online, there's a million different options, I don't know what's good. And I went to a couple stores around me, and they had like nothing, so... I kind of just stumped on what to do with the microphone. But, I do have headphones, so I have those in. And hopefully that'll at least help with the game's audio quality, so it won't be like, kind of picking it up on the microphone as well, my laptop's microphone. So yeah, here we are. I think... There may not be people here yet. I can loiter around a little bit. gonna be kind of a small crowd tonight. But yeah. Okay, cool. Let's get this thing going. <laughs> Good faces. Good. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> okay, so last time we saved Vivi after he got kidnapped by some people and he was underneath this windmill in some weird factory. This seemed to be making black mages so we got to figure out what that's all about we fought a black mage <laughs> leaf you made it good i'm glad that twitch's notifications are so so prompt but yeah last time save vivi fought one of those winged black mages now steiner tricked us into believing that the airship that's about to take off is headed for lindblom when it's headed for Alexandria. So we're gonna go board that, foolishly. <laughs> Good. Email notifications, that seems a little bit annoying. <laughs> Kids these days. Let me get ready to, to act. Let me get ready to emote. Did I ever get, I didn't ever get that treasure chest behind this lady. She won't come out. I'm glad you think so. It's Final Fantasy IX. <clears throat> Leaf, did you make it to any of the other streams of this game? I did two so far. This is the third one. We're gonna board the airship. <laughs> Wait here while I ask the people inside if we can hitch a ride. I shall go ask them. 
Oh, really? How come? It is not for your benefit. I'm only doing this for the princess. Steiner. He was so adamant about going back to the castle before. Hmm. An airship full of barrels like the ones I saw at the castle. Steiner was against going. Sidane, is this ship really headed for Limblum? No, it'll probably take us straight to Alexandria Castle. But why... didn't you just say we should get on the ship? Yeah, I know. Trust me. Sidane, what is it, Vivi? Those dolls they were making underground. Do you think they look like me? How should I answer this? I'll leave it up to you guys. In the meantime, I'll fill Leaf in a little bit. So the girl on the right in orange is a princess. The guy who just ran off is a knight. He's trying to get her back to the castle that she willingly let us kidnap her from. The main character is the blonde guy, Zidane. So we're currently trying to help her get to where she's headed, which is Limblum. And Steiner's trying to get her back. So you want me to say that they looked like him? Okay, we're gonna do it. Maybe a little, but they're just dolls, Vivi. Oh boy. It's moving. What the heck is Steiner up to? Alright, we have to get on, Dagger. On a ship that's not going to Limblum? I don't have time to explain. <laughs> trust him. It's like Aladdin. Do you trust me? This way! Hurry up! You have nothing to worry about. Hurry before she takes off. But it'll take you to Limblum, I promise. <laughs> Fine, I'll get on. It's taking off. Ah! Ooh, soft. <laughs> My god. Come on, it's not like I did it on purpose. Please, enough. There's that royal tone in your voice again. Are you okay, Vivi? It feels like I'm gonna get sucked into the sky. Let's go inside, Vivi. Trust you, Zidane. Slam the door in his face. I get the feeling she doesn't quite trust me yet. Maybe she'll reward me with a kiss or two if I try hard enough. Wow, already? Zidane! What is it? Something wrong? It's Vivi. Vivi? Hello? Wow, they're alive! And they're moving around! So the mages built in the village bring back the new ones? Oh, Vivi. Vivi! Vivi! Were you able to talk to any of them? No. It's like... They don't even... See me at all. I tried again and again, but they won't even turn around. Vivi. I need to go upstairs for a little bit. I gotta turn the ship around before it reaches the castle. Keep an eye on Vivi, okay? Who's behind all of this? Vivi. Oh. Is this a treasure? Yes. <laughs> it's not. I was fooled. What's that? I was just talking to them. 
Hello. Oh. Hmm. Be flying over evil forest soon. Did the boss and the others escape safely? I'm sure the boss would tell me that it's none of my business. <laughs> Happen. What am I to do? I never expected things to go so badly. I cannot believe the ship took off without the princess. What will I say to Queen Braun? What the heck are you doing? You almost took off without us. That is because the ship's crew. Huh. Why you? Where is the princess? In the engine room. She's on the ship? <laughs> All is well now. The ship is returning to the castle. You will be hanged for the kidnapping of a member of the royal family. Enjoy your freedom while you can. <laughs> Shrug. I will not let you near the princess. Really, I guess so. Neat. Cool. <laughs> Steiner's never liked that, ain't got it out for him all this time. Let's see. Let's see who's piloting this thing. <clears throat> At last, Queen Braun is sure to be pleased. However, the princess would have been left behind without the thief's aid. I shall petition for a life sentence on his behalf. Yes, that would be the honorable thing. <laughs> That was because the crew wouldn't listen. I must run a background check on them. Ah, yes. It is my duty as a knight. What the? Sorry, Steiner. <laughs> Uh-oh. Another one. This one looks cooler than all the others. Ray, you made it! Hello. <laughs> ye ye What's wrong, Steiner? Something stuck in your throat? <laughs> you insolent fool! Turn the ship around! <laughs> we'll have your head for that! Oh, here comes all the black mages. Hey, I think we upset them. But they didn't respond to anything until now. You're the one who started this trouble. I apologize. Please wait while I take this fool into custody and turn the ship around. What's wrong? Uh-oh. Schwat's wrong. Oh. No. Vivi! Are you okay? So, number two is defeated by a small child. You are no match against my power. <laughs> Princess, stay there while I eliminate this child. Are you protecting him? Nonsense. You're no different from mindless dolls. What can you do? Get out of my way. Do you dare to fight a black waltz? I said, get out of my way! Ooh. Uh-oh. What 
cruelty. Ah. Master Vivi, I shall assist you. Hey, you guys. Dagger. Yes. We'll take care of the Black Waltz. You steer the ship. Oh my god, no. Don't take the healer out of the party. <laughs> Things are going to get even more dangerous from here on. It's not too late to turn back. You can go back to the castle or cross Southgate into Limblum. It's your choice. I'll be with you either way. But try not to crash the ship. Oh my god. I... No, please come fight with us. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm gonna die. Okay, everybody's fully healed and stuff at least. Be careful, Zidane. I'll be fine. Oh boy. Why? Why would you do such a thing? Weren't they your friends? <laughs> you fool. Do I look like some lowly black mage soldier? Even if they weren't your allies, what you did was reprehensible. <laughs> I'm laughing at you, Espen. <laughs> Worry not about them. Many more are being produced even now. What are you? Ah, the princess's bodyguards have gathered. How very convenient. Answer me. It wouldn't do you any good if I answered, since you're all going to die. <laughs> I will eliminate any who stand in my way. <clears throat> cool. Here we go. And in reference to what Yasmin was saying about them looking like flying monkeys, it's kind of... It's applicable. Like, they're sent by the queen, so... It's kind of the same thing as the Wicked Witch. Oh, Vivi's already in trance. Nice. Fingers crossed that I don't have to... Oh, nice. <laughs> I don't have to do that a million times. Let's see how Thunder does. He seems to be using Thunder Magic himself. Wait, I'll just use one of each. Double black. Eh. Let's see if he's got anything else. Mm. Yeah. Nice. Oh my god. I'm on a roll for stealing. Hmm. One more, see if he has anything else left. Magic is okay. Let's see what Steiner's regular attack does. Oh my god, just getting everything off of them. Ooh, Steiner's regular attack sucks. Uh oh. Cheater. Let's see if I can even reach him. Oh god. Okay, that wasn't that bad. You think you can defeat me? Okay, that hit. Oh. I think I can defeat you. <laughs> ha. You... you scum. I exist only to kill. Dang, dude. Just how many Black Waltzes do we have to fight? This is becoming ridiculous. I think that was the last one. How do you know? Are you... 
He said waltz, right? Don't you think number three would be the last one? Hmm? I can see South Gate. She's gonna go for it. Did you see that? That I did see. I hate these guys. Our enhanced black mages! Our black mage enhancements! All defeated! Betrayed us, Steiner did. It is all his fault. God, look at that face. Huh? Unstable the ship becomes. Don't let go of the steering wheel. No, number three is coming back. True is it? Hooray! But something is wrong. It's broken! Made its magic too powerful, we did. There's nothing we can do now. Depart shall we? We shall depart! Run away! Get out of here. God. Exists only to kill, exists only to kill, exists only to kill, exists only to kill. Oh man. Do you see South Gate? Yes! Southgate is a huge gate built exclusively for airships, but maneuvering through it could be tricky. Do you want me to do it, Dagger? I want to do it on my own. Alright. We don't have clearance. They might close the gate on us. Should be okay, though. Security was totally lax when I came through here on the airship. Theater ship. It'll be fine, Captain Dagger. Roger! <laughs> this dude's problem. <laughs> old, but the engine's got power. We must turn back. Princess, please turn the ship around. The Black Waltz is heading straight toward us on an airship. He might crash into us. Dagger, Rusty's right. It's headed straight for us. Punch it. Go through South Gate. Don't be ridiculous. What if the gate closes on us? There's no way we can outmaneuver him in this cargo ship. We'll slide in before the gate closes and shut him out. That's our only chance. Rusty, turn the power up to max with that lever over there. Dagger, stay on course no matter what. Okay. <laughs> I know we can make it. Oh, Bibby. Come back inside, Bibby. Get him, Vivi! Defeated by his own hubris. Yeah, these cutscenes do definitely do hold up. They're 18 years old. Still looks alright though. And oh my god, we made it to this side of the mountain range. Time to go to Limblum. Limblum is a super cool city. You're all gonna love it. I love it. It's very fun. Look at all these little airships. I'm not moving it, by the way. It's still a cutscene. I think we pushed it a little too hard. Why so silent, people? We made it! Come on, cheer up! Southgate was badly damaged. It was my fault, wasn't it? 
Don't worry about it, they'll fix it up in no time. You idiot. The cargo ship was wrecked, we lost all the cargo, and the south gate was destroyed. I can't believe I played a part in this debacle. Steiner. Yes, Princess. I didn't mean to get you involved, but you saved us. I thank you. Such kind words, I am not worthy. Well, now I've made up my mind. I vow to protect you, Princess, until we return to the castle. How do you feel about that, Dagger? He'll follow you to the end of the world. It's okay, Zidane. Hey, I can see the main gate of Limblum. That's Limblum Castle? How gigantic! The city of Limblum is inside the castle. I guess Dagger and I will go our separate ways once we reach Limblum. I see. Just when we were beginning to get so close. Zidane? Those... black mages and I... Are we... the same? I don't understand, Master Vivi. Just what seems to be the problem? I don't know. Master Vivi, why would those mages be the same as you? And why would it matter if they were? Rusty's right. You're an individual, no matter what happens, Vivi. Right. Let's go out on the deck, Vivi. Why? You gotta see Limblum from above, it's the best. Look, the Falcon's Gate is right in front of us. Just load me up with these cutscenes, man. <laughs> I love the music in the city. <laughs> we are in the castle. Well, let's go take the princess to the king. Wow, this castle's huge. It's even bigger than Alexandria Castle. Yeah, they don't call it Limblum Grand Castle for nothing. An indoor airship dock. This is truly amazing. Even Her Majesty's red robes would easily fit in here. Dagger, you don't look too impressed. You've been here before? Yes, I came here a few times when I was little. I haven't been here since my father passed away. Here comes the welcoming committee. That's a really old airship. Greetings, I am Princess Garnet Till Alexandros. I humbly request an audience with Regent Sid. You must be kidding. No member of the royal family, let alone a princess, would ever ride in such a shabby airship. Look at the company you're keeping. How dare you accuse the princess of lying! The princess was forced to come here under extreme circumstances! Then show me some kind of proof of your royal heritage. Very well. This pendant... is it a falcon claw? No, the shape is a little different. Call me Minister Artania. If you weren't such a filthy looking... Little if you weren't such a filthy looking oaf, they wouldn't be so suspicious of us. Hey, I'm not the idiot with the loud voice and the dirty, rusty armor. What? What is going on? Sir, we have unknown visitors who wish to see the regent. One of them is carrying a parent a pendant that looks like a falcon claw. You were dismissed. I'll take care of this. Yes, sir. Bye. Uncle Artania. It's good to see you, Princess. Please follow me. The Regent is waiting. Hmm? 
shrug. <laughs> cool, here I am. I need to see if there's anything to steal back here. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> <clears throat> Good, cool. Stuff, anything, nothing? What do you have to say? Hey, where'd my ship go? Oh, it's still there. Last regent said the eighth was a great ruler. Haha, uh -huh, so you know what that means? Current Sid is Sid the ninth. Because it's Final Fantasy Nine. <laughs> Cab. I'm taking air cab. Oh, where can I find the? You know, it's in the main dock. Cool. Talk to me. <laughs> Something special. It's carrying the drugs. Undoubtedly, I won't be allowed to take this now. Yeah, no. Nothing. Still want to look around before I do what I'm supposed to be doing. Nothing. Just a really cool view. I'm really glad I got that mod that cleaned up the backgrounds. Because <laughs> Limblum is a very detailed city. This guy. find Uncle Artania. Who's this old man? Taking the day off. Look a bit tense. Let's listen to his story. <laughs> okay. When I was 27. <laughs> oh my god. Good. The Blessing of Water by Melisio, court artisan. 20 years under of rule, blah, 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 blah. 20 years of rule under Sid the Ninth. Hmm. It's like there's no place to insert the metal? If you say so. <laughs> blah, 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 blah. Talk to me. Welcome to Limblum. Shanks. At this point, I don't know where that guy went, so I'm just running amok. You're an airman, right? Seems like a lot of girls are joining the crews these days. Oh, hello. So what are you doing here? Shouldn't you be at the air airship docks or something? I passed the flight test for the new model. I was really looking forward to flying number one, but it's gone now. Who knows when they'll finish number two with the Regent's current condition. Don't worry, you'll get your chance someday. You'll be the first pilot ever to fly the new model. By the way, what's your name? Thank you, I feel much better now. Good, I'm Zidane, and you're... My name is Aaron. Hey, that's a really nice name. Aaron, I need to get something to eat now. Do you wanna... I have to get back now, bye! <laughs> Good. He really is a fuck boy. Uh, he said it before when they were back in that little village dolly. He's always thinking about girls. <clears throat> Treasure. Give. Trash. Nice. Oh yeah, I stole a bunch of equipment from that black mage. I need to equip it. Look, Moogle. Good. Talk to me. Good! It's a letter from Kumop. Kupo Kupo. Thank you very much, Kupo Kupo. Stillskin visited me. Kupo. Said he found a place that seemed interesting. And then he left. I wish he stayed longer, Kupo. Where did he go, anyway? Let me know when you find out. Kupo. Very presumptuous that he would 
definitely find out. I wonder if he stopped in Limblum. I'm sure he did. Do it. Good. <clears throat> Okay. Equipment. What's happening? Did you get anything new? Nope. Well, I'm not taking that stuff off. Because he's still learning magic off of it. Teeple tap. Eh. Maybe. Still learning stuff. Hmm. Hmm. Oh my god, it's so close. Just one more point. Okay. Uh, Steiner! Oh, nice. Yeah, that's right, yeah. Stronger too. Good. Steiner's the tank. Nothing new. Mm, mm. Wait, let me look at Vivi one more time. Let's get the feather hat. Yeah, sure. Sorry, I like sit here talking to myself while I'm doing this. <laughs> Good. No. When will I get accessories? That's it. I want something at least. to kill birds. Open status effect. Hmm. I guess that would be fire. I don't know. I'll experiment with that. I'll have Vivi smack some things with a stick and find out what happens. Okay, where am I going? Whip. Cool. Fun. Productive. Oh, there he is. <laughs> Limblum Castle has three levels, all connected by this lift. From the base level, which lies below the mist, you can take a trolley to the harbor and the back gate. Ships hardly arrive at the harbor anymore since travel by air has become so popular. The mist poses great danger, so we've sealed everything off. Just above the base level is the mid-level. You can ride the air cab from the mid-level to go to town. The upper level contains the royal chamber and conference room. Good. Access to that level is restricted because the regent himself resides there. How do you like that voice? Hey Dagger, what's Regent Sid like? I lived in Limblum for a while, but I've never met him. Regent Sid is very wise. He always thinks ahead. He may seem a bit odd at times, but he's very dependable. He and my father were best friends. She thinks pretty highly of her father. I wonder if he will even listen to what I have to say. Don't worry, we're not leaving until he does. We will arrive at the upper level shortly. Sire, 
Princess Garnet of Alexandria wishes to see you. Princess, is something wrong? The Regent isn't here, and I don't know who... Take a look at the throne. What in the world? <laughs> Creepy. Walk, walk. Greetings! Uh, Oglop! He just punched him. <laughs> Sire! What? What? Tagger, what's wrong? Why aren't you talking to... Jeez, that's an Oglop. Wow, even the Oglops are big and limblum. What is the meaning of this? How dare you greet the princess like this? Get that repulsive bug off the throne immediately. <laughs> Call the regent. Please settle down. You are before the regent. What? Enough of your nonsense. Steiner, stand down. I remember that mustache. Is that really you, Uncle Sid? Yes, greetings all. I am Sid Fagul, Regent of Limblum. I knew it was you. I recognize your pendant's description. It's so much like my falcon claw. I'm delighted to see you again, Garnet. You have truly become a fine lady. I, on the other hand... Allow me to explain. About six months ago, someone snuck into the castle and attacked the Regent in his sleep. Unfortunately, we were too late. The Regent had been transformed into an Oglop, and his wife, Lady Hilda, was abducted. My goodness. Whoever pulled this off had to be highly skilled. Like me. <laughs> I'll bet it was you. That's not possible. How can you be so sure? Do you know who we are? Of course. I may be a bug. But I am still the ruler of Lemblom. Uncle Sid, I appreciate you seeing me on such short notice. I desperately need to speak to you about my mother. That's what I figured. Look at his little stick legs. <laughs> but I'm sure I can wait till tomorrow. Why don't you all get some rest for today? Thank you. It is time for lunch. Please follow me. Into the city. I can't stand the food at the castle. It's way too high class for my taste. How can anyone get full on that stuff? Cheap food here is a lot better. Today's special is... Soup to Silence. Not bad. I think now it's time for my favorite character in the entire game. I'm so excited. Yo, Pops! I'll have the stupid special. <laughs> Who said that? Sidane, I figured it was you. How have you been? Alright, I guess. <clears throat> Have a seat, your soup will be ready in a minute. Do you mind? You're standing in everyone's way. Wow. <laughs> hey. Yeah, do you want a drink? How about you and me go for a cruise on an airship? Really? An airship? Sounds like you've never been on one. You know, Limbum is quite a sight from high above. Hey, Monkey Tail, you're disturbing the other customers. What the? You got a tail too, Rat Face! Rat Face? After I finish my drink, I'm gonna kick your butt. Hey, Zidane, take it outside. <laughs> Long time, Zidane. Hey, what's up? Wait a minute. You forgot my name? No, I remember. You're Helga, right? Wrong. Christine? No! Oh yeah! You used to live next door to me. How's it going, Rachel? Man, you really gotten... big? You nasty little... Come on, I'm just kidding. You know I'd never forget a pretty girl's name. It's Freya! So, how you been, Freya? I'm so excited. I love her so much. Same old Zidane. How long has it been? About three years. Hey, did you ever find out anything about your boyfriend? No. So, what brings you to Limblum? The Festival of the Hunt? What else? It's a good opportunity to test my skills. Ah, well. I'm sure you'll find him someday. 
Aren't you participating? Nah, I think I'll pass. Lazy bum. Are you ever gonna go back? I have no reason to return to Bermatia. There is nothing there for me anymore. Poor Freya. So, how is the Queen? Is she still as vibrant as ever? Yes, but since Father died, Mother's been acting very strangely. I'm not surprised, Guac Guac. They loved each other so much. We haven't spoken much lately. Also, a suspicious man has been prowling around the castle. I don't know what's going on anymore. I fear that she might be planning something terrible. I brought this matter to everybody's attention, but no one is taking me seriously. <clears throat> they all think I'm distraught over losing father. I understand why you're so eager. I'm happy that you came to me for help. At this point, I think you're the only person Mother will listen to. When I heard that Limblum's leadership was coming to Alexandria, I decided to sneak on board and come here no matter what. I just never expected the crew to kidnap me. It was me. I was the one who ordered Tantalus to kidnap you. What? <laughs> I once promised your father, Guan, that should anything happen, I would protect you. We've known about the disturbances in Alexandria for some time. But had we acted directly, it would have started a war. So I asked Baku for help. He and I go way back. The play was the perfect cover to enter Alexandria and get you out. No one would suspect Limblum was behind it. We were faced, forced to take action, because we knew Alexandria would never seek our help. I am relieved we were able to get you out of there. At the village of Dali, we saw numerous black mages. They looked like golems, controlled by some powerful magic. On top of that, they are being created under Alexandria's supervision. I don't know how they're planning to... Blah, blah. I don't know how they're related to Vivi, but if Mother is planning to use them for war... We won't let that happen. Even if she were to command an army of black mages, she won't make a move as long as we have our airship flute. Flirt. Don't worry, Barbara. Everything will be fine. I'm so sorry, Uncle. Now, now, come on. Don't be so formal. I'm helping you because I'm your Uncle Sid, not because I'm the Regent of Limblum. Thank you so much. Aww. I'm glad that Garnet has somebody looking out for her. What is this place? The heart and soul of Limblum, our airship dock. Airship dock. This is dock number one, where we conduct our research walk. But... Where are the airships? Lonely, isn't it? We had a new airship model in here about six months ago. It was our latest creation. It didn't require mist to fly. The man who attacked you, was he the one who ran off with it? Good guess, but no, actually. I met a lovely lady at the pub. Um? When Hilda found out about my little affair, she used her magic and turned me into an oglop. <laughs> Deserved it. And she stormed off in the new airship which I named Hildegard. Pretty ironic, eh? <laughs> she hasn't been back since. I've been working on Hildegard too, but it hasn't been going too well. My mind just isn't the same as an oglop. I am hopeless. <laughs> but that doesn't mean I can't help you. I'll do my best for Alexandria. Thank you. But with Southgate badly damaged, I don't know how we can get back to Alexandria. Don't worry. Southgate is being repaired as we speak. Once the repairs are finished, we'll go to Alexandria. Yes, I'm sure Mother will finally open her eyes to the truth. Hmm. Uncle... Is something wrong? Huh. No, I was just thinking about how the theater ship crashed. Baku sure has good men working under him. Hmm. <laughs> Here's me. Where's Vivi? There's Vivi. Good. Good morning. You're up early. 
Emblem is really a busy place. I've never seen this many people before. I wonder what people go if they want to be alone. Emblem has always been like this. People come here from all over the world. Some of them come here to become airship engineers, sculptors, actors. Wow. I don't re even remember why I came here my first time. Before I knew it, I was living here with my Tamless brothers. Do they still live here? Yeah, our hideout is in the theater district. And you go there right now. Do you want to come along? <clears throat> um, that's okay. I'm gonna go look around town. Okay, I'll give you a little tour. No, that's okay. I can go by myself. Ah, oh, okay. You can find yourself a cute girl, all right? <laughs> Teach me, Mogster. Here we go. I actually need to learn how to do this because I have zero memory. Hey, bruh. What can you teach me today? Lots of new stuff, bruh. Today I'm going to talk about Synthesis Shop. Teach. Yeah, 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 yeah. Because you can make weapons and stuff with this, as well as, like, really good potions and elixirs and junk. Here are some examples. Yes. Okay. I haven't been to Census Shop yet. Go check out the one in Limbo. Oh, speaking of Census, I'll tell you a big secret. Long ago, I heard rumors there's a legendary synthesis who can create of the best items. But I don't know where he lives or what he looks like. Thanks. Gosh, bruh. You should know a lot. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Mogster. Cool. Good. Anything in my room for me to take? No. So I guess it's just sighting. A letter for me. From Ruby. Ain't hey, y'all coming back to Alexandria? I'm so lonely. Just kidding. I'm open I'm opening a little theater in an alley here. Bartender pal of mine is quitting the saloon and getting into showbiz. He asked me to help. My friend is starting a mini theater? Sounds like fun. Good for her. I'm glad that things are going well for Ruby after she was ditched in Alexandria. <laughs> Bye guys. Just Zidane. <clears throat> I need to go find Freya. <laughs> cool. Good. You. The room was terrible. Also that thing crying Koopo Koopo kept me up all night. Throw him out ASAP or I'm never coming back. Lonnie. Remember that name. <laughs> No, I just stayed. What is this? Bobo Bird Statue. Bobo Birds are symbols of good fortune, according to an Olgin myth. The founder of this inn bought the statue and it's been passed down for generations. Good! I don't think that ever becomes relevant again, but there it is. Some little pieces of world building. Small town night in a big city. I totally forgot about Steiner. <laughs> What a huge town. I'm completely lost. Pardon me. Jeez, you're dressed awful funny. I am Captain Adelbert Steiner of Alexandria, and I humbly request your assistance to get back to the castle. <laughs> That's a new one. Nice try, but I don't date bums. Should really scrape that rust off. It's disgusting. Wah. Damn. <laughs> huh? Do you always strike out that badly? I think you need a new line. A little shy wouldn't hurt either. What are these things? They're called Geisel Pickles. They're one of Limblum's delicacies. Do you want to try one? It smells terrible. The worse they smell, the better they taste. I guess I'll try one. <laughs> Grandma Pickle. <gasps> oh. <laughs> oh my, even the locals don't eat them in one bite. 
Whew. But you're right, they are good. <laughs> Steiner likes pickles. What's up, lady? Papa's airship fighter is so cool. When I grow up, I'm gonna fly with Papa. Good. Old man. Air caps. Back in the old days, we had to walk uphill all the way to the theater district in the snow, barefoot, both ways. <laughs> Good. Zeus Festival. Ivan. Female Dragon Knight is participating this year. I'll bet you two cheeseburgers Ivan's gonna win. Okay, you're on. <laughs> it's a good good betting currency. It's a nice fountain. Okay, the city is giant. I'm just gonna kinda roam around it for the next hour. <laughs> 30 minutes. Yeah, it's it's big. It's not literally 30 minutes, but it's big. What's up, lady? <clears throat> maybe. Maybe I did. Hunter's Gate. Keep the Dragon's Gate closed because it's under the mist where a bunch of monsters lurk. Indeed. There's the Hunter's Gate, the Falcon's Gate, the Dragon's Gate below the mist. <laughs> I should have been a Tripite instead. Wow, how did they carve stone like this? Oh, nope. Take me back. <laughs> I've made a mistake. So yeah, that's kind of an interesting thing. You can just leave with nobody else in your party, and you can grind with Zidane and make him, like, massively higher level than everybody else. Let's see what Vivi's up to. Wow, this nut smells really good. I think I'll buy one. This place has a lot of unusual things. Is this food? It looks good. Looks like the sesame buns that Grandpa used to make. Alice's item shop festival, the hunt sale ends today. Wow, this is going to be a festival! Hi, I want to buy this. Oh, are you friends with the Moogles? Huh? Oh my god. Look on the right side of the counter. That little queen brawn doll. Gross. <laughs> The item is called Koopa Nut. Koopa Nuts are Moogle's favorite food. Oh, I didn't know that. I think that's the last one. Go ahead, honey. It's on me. Really? Thank you. Um, what is this festival of the hunt like? Well, we let a bunch of animals loose and... Oh, there's going to be a lot of animals. It sounds like fun. Thank you. Uh, what's so fun about fighting savage beasts? Wait a minute, did I say animals again? <laughs> oh my god. Yes, but no. <laughs> Stop that. <laughs> oh my god. Hey, it's this lady who is farming. Should I play cards against her? Transportation has come a long way when I was young. Back in my day, we used to ride chocobos up hills for 15 miles in the snow, barefoot. They were much slower than these air cabs. It used to take at least an hour by chocobo to get to the theater district. In the snow. Up uphill both ways. Uh huh. <clears throat> it's time to duel? Okay, wait, whoops, wrong button. Okay, I got it, lady. Chocobos. 15 miles in the snow. That's not right. This button. You bet I'm challenging you. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Let me remember. Remember my skills, and also drink some hot chocolate. I'm gonna use the mouse to scroll through my cards. Mm. So my problem last time was not having enough arrows covering all of my bases. side. Maybe that one. Maybe that one. Hmm. I need more on the left side and on the bottom. Oh. 
or just all around coverage. <laughs> Hmm, what do I want for my final card? Maybe this thing. Yeah, I don't- I only have this one with the top left. Ugh. Uh, I want this one for the bottom arrows. Uh, I'm gonna go with this first one. Okay. Yes. Wish me luck. Okay, Grandma. Get ready to get wrecked. Except not actually, because I'm not. God damn it. <laughs> um. <clears throat> I'm already stumped. I should have gone for arrows on the bottom. <laughs> Just put my pig. Thank God. Okay. Okay. Um. Okay, let's find out if P is greater than O. No, wait, I'm just gonna get this one automatically, never mind. God damn it. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. Can I do it? Can I believe? Can I take them both back? Damn it. Oh! Ooh! Oh, I screwed myself. Oh, this is going bad. Things are going bad. Okay, well, at least I didn't lose anything. <laughs> Should I rematch? I'm gonna rematch. One more. Just one more. <laughs> Look at my terrible score. Two draws, one, one win. Okay, let's see. Like, I still don't fully know what the numbers and letters mean. Let me take this thing. <laughs> I'm gonna take this and this. What if I took that one too? When will I fight a Zagnal in the wild? For some reason these flattened cards seem to be better because they actually have not zeros. Of all monsters to have good cards, it's Flan. Maybe I'll take that skeleton. I'll take that skeleton. Here we go. I didn't put quite as much care into picking my cards this time. Let's see if I come to regret that. Hmm. Mm. Uh. I just want to see if P is better than M. I don't think it is at all. <laughs> okay. Don't want to use my weird dragon thing up on this corner. God damn it. Well, at least my dragon thing is safe now. Ooh. So M is better than P, and the bomb and the flan have the same numbers. Cool. Ooh! Oh, that hurts. Oh my god, that's not okay. <laughs> oh god, I'm gonna lose real bad. Um. Uh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh boy. Oh, get the hell out of here! Oh my god. <laughs> oh god, I think I'm gonna lose. Yep, oh god. <laughs> get it together, Raw. Uh, too late. Oh, oh, the one that had all the arrows. The one that was better than P. M's are better than P's. Nope, I'm out of here. <laughs> Goodbye, really good flan card. Have fun with that, Grandma. I hope you're proud. I hope you're proud of yourself. Squashed a child's dreams. <laughs> okay, I'm out of here. Wait. Nope, okay, I'm out of here. <laughs>
Okay. This oops this. Bleh. This was to the gate. <clears throat> okay. Let's see what this fish man wants. Talk to me. Go away! I'm trying to remember what I have to do. Silly old man. Can I go up the staircase? Let me in. Let me in. Nobody wants this monkey child to come into their home. <laughs> you. Tiny chef. The head chef at the castle. Good. Wait, I want to take a look at tiny chef. Oh my god. Their hat comes down over their face. <laughs> Good design. Hey, Grandma. Where'd Steiner go? Shell pickles are good, but they smell really bad. Should I call that character Yasmin from now on? Grandma Pickle? <laughs> <laughs> Look at all this stuff. I want to steal things. Out of it. Hey, where'd Steiner go? I know we hit on you. Just came to watch a festival. Let's make some souvenirs. What a bummer. I hate buying gifts. Oh, glob oil. That's so disgusting. <laughs> I'm getting sick. The air is so bad here. <laughs> Smells like I'm in a big oil refinery. Yeah. Industrialization. <laughs> the card game is deep. Okay. I would definitely lose to him. What's this? Card collector number seven. Regarding rare cards. Rare cards are priceless. The cards you're carrying could become rare cards. For Bull Publications. If you say so. Scoot. Look at this little bird. That's adorable. Oh, treasure, I didn't even see that. It's too busy looking at these little birds. They're so cute. Give it to me. <laughs> I wanna go on the balcony. That's really cute. I just can't get over that. Oh, let me down. Oh, wait, this is the guy. The wimpy guy. <laughs> that would be me here. It's like coughing because of all the smog in LA. Oh. <clears throat> Grandma Pickle is Yasmin from now on. <laughs> Pepe's Milk Shop. Okay. Priscilla. Theatership blew up and crashed in Alexandria. You bet it did. A lot of commotion in Alexandria lately. I was on that ship. Crashed into evil forest. Grandma Potpourri. Would you like to buy a flower pot? You can use it as cookware, too. I'm carrying a lot of nice pots right now. Yasmin, do you want to be Grandma Pickle or Grandma Potpourri? <laughs> You're not crazy for this year's festival. I'm going to win for sure. Hmm, maybe I'm gonna win the festival. I'm probably not. <laughs> I'll enter it though. Mucus Coffee. Hey, where's Silver? <laughs> Serve top grade coffee. 10% of our coffee beans are from the coffee rich heights of Norwich. Somebody screenshot this to give to Silver. Rio, I'm bored. Let's go to another store. Come on! In a minute! Jeez. He's too busy staring at swords. I remember a guy with spiky hair who carries something like this. <laughs> so, another seven reference. I'm gonna become a gladiator. Dragoose. If you want to come out on top of the festival, buy some weapons here. Give me your things. <clears throat> well, yes, that is a throwback. It's Cloud and his giant buster sword. Yes. <laughs> so Mogster told me that if I had two of these, I could get some other weapon. The ogre dagger or something like that. I've got the money to spare. Ooh. I've already got one. I'll wait. I'll wait on that javelin. She's got that equipped. Mmm, I'll wait on that fork, too. Crappy. 
Mm hmm. I'll get one. Got him. Got him. Got two. I'll oh, wait. Got it. Yeah. Oh. Good. Cool. But nobody's in my party right now, so <laughs> I'll just equip him with this thing for now. Chakra. This. Hmm. You gotta wait for base killer. But yeah, good, good. Getting there. Wait. Wait, yeah, one more. Hmm. Okay, I'll wait till he learns detect. Good. <clears throat> I'll worry about his abilities later. Okay, yeah. Oh yeah, somebody screen that screenshot that and then give it to Silver. <laughs> What's this? Oh yeah. Oh, Vivi was just here. Oh my god. Hello, Hannah. Something's... One more time. <laughs> Frightening. Look at those teeth. Horse teeth. Think you're gonna need some medicine if you're gonna participate in the festival. I'm good on all this stuff, actually. I need to look at this thing. Tell me about it. I wanna see this. Oh my god, please. It's just talking to her. <laughs> face. I want to read about the festival. No. no. Okay, let's keep keep meandering. <clears throat> the fire is too strong. How many times do I have to tell you? A few degrees can make the difference between a good weapon and a bad one. Use a lower flame. Stop nagging, we've got a customer. When is he gonna get it through his head? <laughs> well then, what have I walked into? How's it going? Do I make you something for the festival? You bet I do! Ooh. Ooh. I bought- oh, I have it equipped, that's why. What am I learning? Detect- oh god. Oh god. Mm. <clears throat> Steel hat. Desert boots. Glass buckle. I don't wanna. Oops. I don't wanna get rid of anything that. I'm holding off on learning stuff from. Hmm. I'll come back here. After I mold things over, I might do this off screen. He has the potential, but he doesn't work hard enough. What an old man. Oh, I just stole some silver gloves. Okay, that's great. Kids these days. Millennials these days, am I right? Don't work hard enough. What is this thing that I just received? I already forgot what it was. It was gloves. It was probably for Steiner. Yeah. Definitely for Steiner. <laughs> Get bent, old man. Okay, let me see. Where am I going now? Up. North. North ways. this door? No. Hello, lady. Nice hair. I hate the festival a lot. My father gets injured every year. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm sorry for you. What is this? A puppo. Erf. Erf. Morf. Good. Excellent. Okay. Nope. Okay. Uh-oh. 
<laughs> Get stuck behind the dog. This church has been here for a long time. It's been here since before the city was even built, when this entire area was a forest. That's cool. I don't know why, but this church began the festival of the hunt tradition. Well, if it was in the middle of a forest, that's probably why. A forest full of monsters. Does that mean Freya is in here? Hello, man. It's gonna be exciting. She's asleep. Bullcut child, talk to me. Play cards with me. Wake up, Grandma! She sleeps everywhere. Founder of Limblum said the first was the winner of the first festival. Said the first built this church to pass on the tradition of the festival. Good. You've got a good face there. Priest Theodore. It's neither a joke nor a traditional pastime. It is a way of life. <laughs> Dang. Be aware. Oh boy. I don't know what I'm getting myself into here. <clears throat> Never hunters. So we'll begin around that time. It truly is a way of life. Don't mind me just climbing all over your scaffolding. Just want to see. Nice. Free stuff. <laughs> the disrespect. Grandma, wake up. Oh my god, let me out. <laughs> let me out from behind this altar. Now nah, Grandma's out. Grandma's out cold. There's no coming back from that. Old man. Cool. Good. I think I need to go back into the castle and take the little air cab to the other districts. <laughs> Get woke, Grandma. <laughs> so that's what I'm going to do. I'm going back to the castle. I I don't actually know how to get to the castle. Because I didn't just sort of appeared in that inn without any like Let me see. Let me see. Is it here? No? That leads straight out of the city. I think it's here on the left. Maybe? Oh my god. Nope, that's the end that I came out of. I'm lost in Limblum. <laughs> uh, there we go, okay. I knew it was somewhere around there. Good day. Take me to place. Um, if I go to the theater district, that's where I'm supposed to go. And go to the industrial district and keep looking around or back to the castle. What do you guys think? Well, I have some hot chocolate that's gone cold. That's where I'm at, too. <laughs> I'm, I might just go for the industrial district for the sake of continuing to look around. Is that the pros and cons of each? I don't know. Theater district will just continue the storyline. Anything else, like, I won't miss anything, I don't think. Yeah. Yeah, I don't think going to the castle or to the industrial district after the storyline, I don't think I'd miss anything. But I can satisfy my curiosity before continuing the plot. If I go to the theater district last. Industrial district, then. Good. <clears throat> it's kind of where I was feeling, too. Good. 
Here we are. Good. Good day. Let's learn about airships. I see. Nimitz. Oh god. <laughs> There's a big highway on the island that I'm from called Nimitz Highway. <laughs> Which actually... Uh, this game was made in Hawaii. Square Soft had a big studio in Honolulu that this game was made in, along with Final Fantasy Spirits Within, that weird CGI movie that nobody likes. <laughs> and these were the last two projects that that company did before they closed it, back in 2001, 2002 or something. So yeah, this game is Hawaiian, just like me. <laughs> the region built the statue and said the eighth passed away. <clears throat> cat. Show me cat. I want to speak with cat. Fine. Sid the Eighth developed the first mispowered airship in 1762, led the airship armada in 71, and brought peace to the continent. Died 1780. In honor of my father, Sid the Ninth. That's nice of him. You can't see the statue's face, so that's kind of interesting. Maybe I can? Almost? Uh, not really. If I went up that staircase, maybe, but that'd probably take me to a new screen. This is amazing. Can't find architecture like this anywhere. This Regency is so advanced. Uh... <laughs> in the front. No! Putting in the back is more effective. Putting the engine in the front provides more stability, but less power. Oh, I see. Well, those engineers are weird. Why is that? <laughs> in the back. That's right. You're a smart guy. Nobody believes what I say. Putting the engine in the back results in more power. If you say so, let me in. Relocation notice. The store's moved to Fogger Plaza in the business district. Oh, been there already. Shopkeeper Dragoose. Let me through. Let's see what this is. Nothing. Nothing? Is this not a way to go? Nope. I'm lost behind the statue. Dude. Things. Okay, I'm going up the staircase. Okay, there you can see the statue's face. <laughs> ah, Anteater. Widget. Sid the Eighth developed the first Miss Powered Engine. Had a pet cat. Since then, a lot of engineers went out to get cats. I had my own too. Her name is Gypsy. Is that Gypsy up on that pipe right next to the text box on the right? <laughs> Cute cat. I'm glad there's cats around here. Sweet. Look at all this stuff I'm finding. Ugh, what the heck was in that dish? Poor Barry. Oh. Oh, here we are. Ah, icy cold root beer. Root beer, you say? <laughs> I want to talk to the bartender. Hey, lady. Oh, I'm sorry. We're all at a dark stew. Creepy. Cujo. Good name. Pickles. <laughs> oh my god. <clears throat> Good bar. Guess what? Good. Aw. Lidruff. Not gonna believe it. It's a steam engine. It's still a prototype. House gets hot as hell while this baby's running. That's the only problem. Getting thin from sweating so much. Cool. I wanna look at it. I know what it is. You just told me. I need to look at this cat and steal your treasure. More cards. Good. Excellent. Good. Superb cat. Very good. <laughs> this is... Truly, this is the industrial district. I see why that guy was complaining about the air quality. 
No, it was at the bar. Wait, is there like an upstairs or anything? I want to be up on that upper balcony where that lady was walking outside. to be there. I want to be where the people are. Nothing. Nothing. So one bad thing about these, like, static backgrounds, it's kind of hard to tell sometimes where you can and can't go. <laughs> but okay, that's everything. It's time to head to the theater district. We've already been to the castle. I don't think there would be a whole lot of new stuff to do there. I got the treasure chests already. <laughs> Onward with the plot. <clears throat> you were just thinking that it's kind of hard to tell where you can and can't go? <laughs> Steam engine! We were just there. Steiner. I'm lost again. Where is the princess? The town is big. The castle is big. Why does everything have to be so big? <laughs> Pardon me. Can you tell me where I am? Why, you're lost? Gee, you're a soldier for crying out loud. Thanks, old man. This is a bridge that connects the castle and the airship docks. That big building in front of us houses the docks. Cool. Dang. W what is that large airship? Amazing, isn't it? It's the Hildegard II. Since it is equipped with a steam engine developed by the Regent himself, it can fly without mist. Impossible. How can it fly without being powered by mist? What cave did you just crawl out of? This is the age of steam power. The source of steam power is water. It's much safer than mist. <laughs> A bright future awaits us all. It's a very, very forward thinking, Grandpa. Cool. A little bit more background into the world. Especially in the theater district. Almost everyone here plays. <clears throat> My wife is a crazy Lowell fan. Lowell. <laughs> That's all. My husband gets so jealous. <laughs> Cute birds. Oh, I'm sorry. Aw. I like to come here and feed the pigeons. Precious. But yeah, like you said, Red, I was going to say something else about it being difficult to spot things, and I totally forgot what it was when that little cutscene started. <laughs> Looking forward to the festival. I'm gonna use a festival as a theme for my next painting. Good. I like your cat. I like your chocobo statue. All good things. Good. Did it? Okay. I am glad that I went with this mod though, because like every single shot of the city would be super hard to make out if it was the original low low res backgrounds. She's late. What's Marissa doing? Oh hell. <laughs> That's how I curse. Oh hell. <laughs> Is this Marissa? You gonna go see Lowell too? No. Yeah, I don't think he'd want to see you either. Maybe I am going to go see him then. You know, I'm not surprised. Even if I were a guy, I'd still be in his fan club. He's so great. <laughs> well then. Look at all this treasure. Look at that little doll up on the bed. Figured there wouldn't be anybody here. Looks like no one's been here for a while. Tantalus's little hideout. What to do? What to do? Oh. Jeez, it's that late already? 
I wonder what Dagger's doing. Uh -huh. What can I do? Dagger. The bell's ringing. The performance in the theater district must have just ended. Is there anything you need, Your Highness? No, thank you. I'm thinking of going outside and having a look around. I'm sorry, Your Highness, but we cannot grant this request. Right now, there are many people coming to Limblum for the Festival of the Hunt. Therefore, things are quite chaotic in the town, making security rather difficult. Also, very few people know of your presence here. It's for your own safety. Please understand. Okay, I understand. I can't stand sitting around like this. I didn't come here to be protected. I just want to help Mother. Poor Dagger. Oh! Bunce! There he is. Told you he'd be here. Why didn't he tell us you were back? We're in Tantalus too, you know? What? <laughs> yeah. Uncle Baka said if he finds some treasure, we can be in Tantalus too. Yeah, check this shit out. Wow, those are Trick Sparrow's wings. That sure is some treasure you found, alright? Yay! Yippee! Zidane's good with kids, even if he is a bit of a womanizer. So did the plan work? Yeah, Princess Garnet is at the castle. Really? Wow. So what's she like? Is she cute? Did you ask her out yet? <laughs> no. I think she's pretty busy. Plus, she's a princess and I'm a, you know, so... I don't know. I bet she misses you. Yeah, you should go see her. Good luck. See ya. Tehe. <laughs> I wonder if she got to talk to Sid. Maybe I should go see her. Nice. Let me just rob my fellow theater troupe of all of their money. <laughs> Dang. I feel a little bit bad, but they're all thieves anyway, so whatever. <laughs> Mini Burmacia. What the heck? No. Oh, look at all the stuff I have. That's garnets. The road remains wide open while your dreams are alive. Only fear can block the way. Iron Tail Crowley. Kuponut, Via Vivi. Moguta, good quote, Ares. The story of twelve zodiacs. The eleven zodiacs pondered. How best to catch Virgo's heart? Ares headed east. Stelazio story. Mini Bermatia. It's the most coveted piece of the famous triptych. You'll never see a rare item. Uh-oh. Yasmin's connection is dying. Let me know if you miss anything, and I can fill you in. <laughs> you touch that red bonbon-looking thing on your head. Baku sleep talking. Come see the all-time classic love story, I Want to Be Your Crow. <laughs> Tragic tale of destiny, cursed memories, dreams, life, and death. That was Vivi's ticket from when he was first going to go see. I want to be your canary. This fake ticket. <clears throat> blah, blah, blah. Aha. Baku and his crew. Oh my god. I haven't seen them since Evil Forest. Apparently they made it out of there alive. <laughs> Sneezing whole gang, except for blank. Whew, that tasted good. Can't believe we found a way out of Evil Forest before it got petrified. It's all thanks to our bro who pointed out the river before he took the map to Zidane. What do we do now, boss? We gotta save our brother. You're right. But first, let the guys outside drink some water from the lake. Sinna, bring them over. Hey, about blank. I think it's better the evil forest stays petrified. Are you serious? Don't get me wrong. I ain't saying this out of concern for our safety. Then why? I'm sure he wouldn't want to be saved if it meant evil forest was going to be restored too. You're right. We gotta start looking. 
There's got to be another way to cure his petrification somehow. We ain't too late. We gotta do what we can. I got you, boss. T for Tantalus. There's also, on the same island that Nimitz Highway is on, there's a big mountain called Tantalus on the south side, like right outside of Honolulu. <laughs> Hey, Senna, what are you doing over there? This spring water might make some good coffee. I'll get the fixins. Do I gotta remind you what happens to members who don't listen to their boss? No, please not that. I'll bring everyone over right now. <laughs> good, they're gonna fix Blank and I don't have to worry about doing that myself. Where is she? You. No. I don't think he'd want to see you either. What's that? Memorial Theater. Let's go see the theater. Oh, it's not letting anybody in. Stop pushing! Hey, who are you? Who am I? I'm Sir Zidane of Tantalus, the greatest bandit in the world. Have you ever heard of him? No. Go away! Stop bothering us! Ouch! <laughs> Hurry up! Where's Lowell? <laughs> oh my god. How much longer do we have to wait? Please, he'll be here in a minute. Uh oh. I love you! Hi, everyone. <laughs> Hold my hand, kiss me, Lowell! What's so special about him? Thanks. I love you guys. Great. See you all again. Hold my hand. Oh my god. Ouch. Damn, I can't see a thing. Thank you for coming to see Moogle Wannabe 2. Koopo. We don't care about you and your stupid show. We came to see Lowell. Phew. Hey, you're... No, I'm not. Meow. Bye. Poor guy. It's tough being popular. I should know. <laughs> you just get rebuked by four people all at the same time and he's calling himself popular. We proudly present Moogle Wannabe 2, performed by Zawix Company, the company that gave a stellar rendition of I Wish I Were a Chocobo. Great. Lowell Bridge just plays Ubobo. Good. I want to see I Wish I Were a Chocobo. Sold out. Can't even see Moogle Wannabe 2. Man. I still haven't given him my cookies. I'm dying to see him again. Do you think he'll come out again? He just did. Oh, I'm so in love with him. <laughs> Good. I wonder where he went. Well, finding the other members of Tambalus was a bust, so... Where to now, Zaydu? You're all alone, in the big city. I guess just back to the castle. <clears throat> Let's go find that Garnet and see if she got to talk to Regent Sid. No, I didn't see a big moogle. Darn. Did you? Just so you know, air cabs run. Non-stop, around the clock. Good day. Good. Let me on. We'll go catch up with Garnet. <clears throat> I need to call her Dagger. <laughs> Steiner's probably here too. It's leaving me. I guess I'm stuck here. Oh no, there it is. Never mind. <laughs> Theater man. Checking out my real junky cargo ship. Talk to me. Wow, check this baby out. She's a classic. They use the ship's engine as the basis for all other airships. Nothing compares to this baby. Can't call yourself a true airman until you've ridden a wooden barge like this one. Well, I'm glad somebody appreciates it. <laughs> Come on. 
good. <clears throat> this way. Oh, hey. Sorry, only on those personnel can use lift. God damn it. Now what? I think Dagger was up here. She's still here? Hey! What are you doing here? You! What have you done with the princess? Where is she? Whoa, take it easy. I just got here. The princess is gone! She was supposed to stay in this room! Maybe she went out for a little walk. How can you be so calm? This is a very serious matter. Have you forgotten all the dangers she just faced to get here? What if something terrible happens to her? What am I doing here? I must go find her. Out of my way. Well, good, I'm glad she escaped again. <laughs> it's constantly breaking out of castles. Let's go catch up with Steiner. I wonder where she went. <laughs> good. Enjoy your nap. I'm not allowed to go up there. That song. I've heard it somewhere before. That sweet voice. It's Dagger. She's upstairs. Upstairs? Let me up. Let me up. Man, I've got to get past this guy somehow. Maybe if I disguise myself as a guard, he'll let me through. Say that right in front of him. So I guess she didn't didn't quite escape the castle. Hey buddy, you're not using your clothes. Hey, wake up! Huh? I just saw a suspicious character wandering around. What? Where? Upstairs, follow me. <laughs> God. No, in here! Huh? Alright, you bastard! Show yourself! Hey, what are you doing? <laughs> oh my god. That was easy. Say it ain't your menace. Sup, pal. Good day, sir. I should be able to get on the lift now. Sup, friend. Good day, sir. The lift is running fine as always. Thank you, person that I definitely know and have a long standing relationship with. <laughs> Where is she? My footsteps are echoing. Hmm. Cool. That girl? Oh yeah, I saw her go upstairs just a while ago. Well, in that case, I'm gonna go in the opposite direction. <laughs> Finish looking around. And listen to her sing a little bit longer. Oh, okay. No, okay, I guess I'm just going that way then. Wake up. How dare you sleep on duty? I was close. Okay. <laughs> Back here? Nope. Dagger. Where's she at? This song is very peculiar. Yeah, you can't hear a song like that anywhere on this continent. She's such a Disney princess. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> Tracked in all these fucking birds. <laughs> Dagger. Nice song. 
How did you get up here? This is a restricted area. Come on, I do this for a living. <laughs> oh yeah, you're a member of Tantalus. Must have been easy for you. Hmm? Wow, what a view. Hey, there's a telescope. Let's go check it out. Come on. Hmm. Trying to woo who puff away things. Neat. Ooh. Good. Oh, there's South Gate. I wonder if they started repairing it. It'll probably take a while to fix everything. Airship. Chocobo. Fantastic. Hey, there's a chocobo. Maybe I can catch a chocobo in that forest. Hell yeah, I'm gonna catch a chocobo in that forest. Mountains. Arab mountains. Alexandria's beyond those mountains. I bet they're looking for us. Hmm. Hmm. More mountains. Arab mountains. Those are the mountains that surround Bermatia. I guess the best way to get there is through the cavern at the base. I want to go to Bermatia. We're gonna go to Bermatia. Marsh. Marshland. There's probably a lot of weird things living there. Maybe I should check it out sometime. Hell yeah, I'm gonna check out the weird things in the marsh. I'll do that as soon as Limblum's done, actually. I just want to look at that chocobo for a while. That's great. That's good stuff. Fantastic. That's adorable. <laughs> okay. Good. Oops. I was supposed to find something in particular. River. Seabell River. That river flows right by South Gate. You can get to the gate by walking along the river. Let me see. How's the view? I've made so much trouble for everyone. Uncle Sid knew everything. That's why he asked Tantalus to get me out of Alexandria. No matter how hard I try, I'm always a step behind in everything. I'm so helpless. What's wrong? Zidane. Why did you help me come here, to Limblum? Is it because your boss ordered you to? I just wanted to help you, that's all. The boss didn't agree with me, so I ended up leaving the band. Really? I'm sorry. Eh, don't worry about it. It isn't the first time I've left. Sidane. Yeah? Oh, um... How were you planning to abduct me? We're gonna put you to sleep with sleeping weed, then kidnap you. It's mostly used for kids, but a big dose can knock out an adult just as easily. I guess you didn't need it, since I came along on my own. Hey, would you mind giving me some? I've had a hard time sleeping lately. Um, I don't think that's a good idea. You might get addicted. Uh, maybe all you need is some company, eh? Oh please, do you think I'm that naive? <laughs> Can't blame me for trying. Um, that... <clears throat> that song. Were you singing it in the village of Do village of Dolly? Yes. So, you were up that night. What is that song anyway? I don't know. I can't even remember where I learned it. I sing it whenever I feel sad or lonely. For some reason, it comforts me. Reminds me that I'm not alone. I guess it's a mystical song. Let me hear it again. Oh. Hmm. I never expected to find such fine armor in a place like this. Yes, I'll buy that one too. Hamster man. Who knows when that brawn will start another war? What? The queen would never start a war. Hamster man? You dare speak ill of the queen? Who the hell are you? 
I'm a an armor collector. Oh, well, in that case, can you recommend some good armor? I I must go. Hmm. Go, Knights of Pluto. Yeah. What are those things? They look so stupid. I'm gonna take Sid's airships and destroy them. Hey, cut it out! You broke my knight! I'm gonna tell your mom! No, come on! <laughs> Royal action figures? Those black mages were like toys being controlled by someone. Aww. Freya, the sky looks ominous. Something's about to happen. Sir Fratley, where are you? I need you. Everybody's so troubled. Even him. Okay. It should work now. Sire, it's no good. What? We can't stabilize the engine system. It can't run for more than ten minutes. Darn it. My mind hasn't been the same since I became an Arglop. Hey, Dagger. So, when do you want to go on that airship cruise? What are you talking about? Hmm? What am I thinking? I asked the girl at the... <laughs> Never mind. Well, sounds like you've asked the wrong girl. Wait, I can explain. Why bother? Go have a wonderful time. Oh, man. Okay, how about this? If I get first place in tomorrow's hunting festival, you and me will go out on a date. How does that have anything to do with me? <laughs> Come on, please. Fine. Okay, it's a date. <laughs> Maybe tradition, but this is a dreadful festival. So many lives lost every year, especially because of him. Hardly. Festival is a test of manhood. I tingle with excitement every year. I don't like the way he said that. This is the last carriage. All the preparations for the festival hunt are complete. Very good. Now we wait for the signal. Oh god, here we go. <laughs> I guess it's starting early. The fangs have been freed. What? We haven't even received the minister's authorization. We believe that they're going to release him any minute. Alright, release the moose before they let him loose. Hurry! Moose. <laughs> Just round up a bunch of monsters and let them loose in the city streets. Good festival. Alright, stand by. This year's specimen is perfect. Nothing can stop him. Oh boy. <laughs> what power? Hey, make him stop. It's too early to let him loose. How? I have no control over him. Damn it. Open the gate at once. The gate's gonna fall apart. Go, Zagnol! I've got a bunch of cards of that thing. <laughs> Where's Sidane? Freya's here! For some reason, Freya is here. I missed Steiner's dialogue. <laughs> what if Sidane did something about that? Hey guys, sorry I'm late. Alright, let's begin. So, it's 9.55. I'm not entirely sure how long this Festival of the Hunt stuff will take. I'd say like 20, 30 minutes at the most. I will leave it up to you guys. I should stop right here or just do the festival and see what happens. I don't know how long it'll go. <laughs> but yeah, Festival of the Hunt. Hunters on your mark. Ferocious beasts swarm about the castle town. The bigger the catch, the higher the score. Time list 12 minutes, okay. Use air cabs to go to other districts. Once you lose in a battle, you'll be forced to retire. So it's 12 minutes at the most. I'll probably lose. <laughs> Winner will be crowned Master Hunter and receive the Hunter's Reward. Who will come out on top? What do you wish for your Hunter's Reward? I'll go with Gil all the way. I'll take an add-on. And you, Mr. Vivi? What? <laughs> 
I never signed up. I thought you would do pretty well, so I signed you up. <laughs> don't worry, with your black magic, it'll be a piece of cake. Uh, I don't know. That was very inconsiderate of you, Zidane. Oh. How about this? If you win, I'll fix you up for a date with Dagger. Me and the princess? Shh, keep it down. She puts her hands on her hips up there. What was that? You just mentioned the princess. What evil deeds are you plotting now? It's nothing. Right, Vivi? Yeah. So what would you like for your reward? Oh, um, I'll take a card. Okay, Gil, and add on and a card. The festival will begin shortly, you all have different starting points. Hunter Zidane will start in the theater district, Frey in the industrial district, Vivi in the business. Cool. Okay, cool. I think I just talked to that guy to start the festival. So, let me know what you think. If anybody is still awake in the chat. <laughs> <clears throat> it's still only as I in the party. Want to outfit people with equipment. Let me look at his abilities while I'm here. Okay. Oh. Yeah, Beast Killer is a good ability to have for the Festival of the Hunt. Leaf's gonna Z snizz soon. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. If nobody else answers, then I'll take that as a everybody else is asleep <laughs> and just call it for now. But yeah. Let's kind of look around in the meantime. Thank you. Nothing, nothing. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <clears throat> Can't go up there, because I'm just a dirty peasant. Better hurry. Oh. Okay. I'm gonna go stand in front of this guy and save again. And we'll call it a night. And the next stream will be Tuesday, 8 p.m. West Coast time. Oh, I have to just go there myself, okay. <laughs> but yeah. Okay, next stream's gonna be Tuesday, 8 p.m. I mean, same time as this one began. So I'll see you guys there. Thank you for coming. This was super fun. I'll catch everybody up on what happened this time, next time, because I expect that seems like more people are gonna be able to get here Tuesday. So till then, good night, you guys. Good night. Good night. Thank you. You're welcome, I mean. <laughs> Thank you for thanking me. <laughs> See you guys around. Oh my god, Silver. Good night, Silver. <laughs> the stream is ending. Bye.